the play date. This is by far my favorite day of the month. This is the one day every month that the team and myself get together in the studio and make stuff. It started off as just here and there, we'd get together whenever we could, but over the course of last year, we've turned it into a hard calendar date. And we've booked these a few months in advance. To me, they're just as serious as any paying gig that I have in my book. And only under emergent distress would I ever think of moving or canceling one of these play dates. As Marina says, there's no rules, no agenda, no judgment, just plain fun. And that's, that's really the motto of the day when we all get together. And it leaves any one of us open to speak or toss ideas around and bounce things off of each other and just simply make without any pressure. Now, this is nothing new and groundbreaking. I know people that do this kind of thing all the time. But I can tell you this, if you aren't doing it, you should be doing it. If you're not setting aside days, then you're doing a great disservice to yourself and to your clients and prospective clients, because that means you're not practicing and you're not pushing and you're not trying things out. It's hard to push the envelope when you're on set with timelines and budgets. And I'm not saying that you can't do it on set, but there's a lot more riding on it. There's a lot more pressure to create and to make it right quickly. The play date gives you that opportunity to try out new gear or a new piece of lighting or a technique that you read about or some weird pose or the idea that you've been kicking around in your head for months. This is your time to, to get it out. So this month we had one model sitting for us and Danny is actually a wildly talented makeup artist. So she's used to being on our side more so. But she's an all around sweet badass and she was down for the journey and nice enough to lend us her entire afternoon and evening. So we filmed a little behind the scenes. Now it's nothing spectacular at all. There's no sexy slow motion camera movements or lighting. I basically just left my phone on the counter and whoever wasn't doing something at the time could just pick it up and film for a few seconds. And so here's our day wrapped up into 90 seconds. Enjoy. The shots at the end there, those were just things that we were marking as they came out of camera. And those images are just that. They came out of the camera, they hit capture one, they got whatever color tweak we were adding on the fly, and then just JPEG export for this video. So no, no finessing or retouching or pixel pushing yet. But if you wanna see the finished product, head over to my Instagram and there's a few images there today and I'll be releasing more over the course of the next week. And go follow Fawn and Marina because they're incredible and they'll be sharing stuff as well. Links for everyone are below. So click them, follow them, they're good people. That's it, head over to Instagram, check out all the shots, thumbs up hopefully, leave me a comment if you want, subscribe if you haven't, and I'll see you next week.